Hi everyone. Is the it is common it is common in IGCSE task 3 or practical paper of the ICT. It will ask you to create a file from the given outline. So in this case in task 5 normally is a presentation or using a PowerPoint. So now, is this a common instruction? They ask you to create a presentation of six slides using the file expected. So what you're going to do is, once you open your PowerPoint, in case you don't remember, here I demonstrate how. Once you open your new presentation, what you need to do, you have, you have to go to the new slide and then you choose outline or similar name but must find outline and click on it and then you can find you you can insert the file that expected to you for inserting so for here it says expected file normally it's in the dot rtf it or call in rich text format and you click insert so it will give you a six slides outline so you come back to the instruction, it said here, create a presentation of six slides. So because it's only six, what you need to do is just to delete the first one. You can right click and delete or click delete on your keyboard. So click on the slide, the first slide and click delete. So now you have slide one, slide two, slide three, slide four, slide five and slide six. So then you can come to the second. The next thing you have to do, format slide 1 so that a title slide layout is applied. The title and subtitle are centered on the slide and your name appears after the text summary of key findings by. So I will show you how to complete this first two first and then you can continue by yourself. So for the first one they said, slide 1, choose the slide layout of title slide. And then it said here in the instruction, the title and subtitle are centered on the slide. So you come back to the slide and make sure all this in the this paragraph, left, centered, right or decify. So in the instruction, they want you to make sure it is centered. And then the last one, they want you to make show your name appears after the text summary of key findings by so you come back to the slide and you type in your name here so make sure you save your work frequently and then you can continue and refer your textbook for for the following tasks